Hi guys, so today I have another charm update and most of the charms that I'll be showing you guys are just charms that I wanted to make for a while but some of them are also custom orders and I'm sorry about my voice, I have a cold right now but I really wanted to make this video soon so let's get started first I have this frog which is a little different from the style frog I used to make so this one it has arms and legs and a different face then i have this bunny and it is laying down like in this cute position and this was inspired by i mean image i saw and then I made this Holang charm. And I don't think I made a Molang before, but it was really fun and easy to make. And then I made some Molang dust plugs. So I have this plain one right here. And this other one, he's holding a cup of chocolate. And let me just show you how they look like on a cell phone. It looks like this. So here's the other one. But for some reason the Molang doesn't go all the way in as you can see. But it looks like this. And then I also made this kitty dust plug. And on the back, his tail is dangling. And this was inspired by a dust plug I saw on Strapia. And I had one like this in the past, but I lost it. So I thought I'll try to make it again. So moving on, I also made this um, other kitty from the same series of the last one, but I just made this into a regular charm and I have another kitty so I made a bunch of kitties this time so this one is just a white cat then I made these two aliens from Toy Story and this one has the blue expression and this one is just smiling next I have this dog then I made this other two dogs and they are Dachshunds so it's a brown and a black one next I have this little teddy bear then I have Coney and Brown again but they're like a couple's charm holding a heart and then I made this Tirakuma on a ribbon strap thing so I've been experimenting with this kind of strap and last I have some cabochons again so I have this hello kitty but with a red bow I have kutsushi tanyanko and then I have this puka head and the last thing I have to show are these ladybugs cabochons so I made four of them so here's an overview of all the charms I made and some of these charms will be available on my Etsy shop soon so keep an eye out 
and if you want a specific tutorial you can request it below in the comments and thanks for watching